Today, I'm going to do a tutorial on how to create a deep fake voice. We're going to use a tool called voice.ai. You can go to that URL voice.ai to download the desktop app. And the desktop app is only available on Windows. It's not available for Mac OS. So I went ahead and downloaded it already. So we'll go ahead and dive right in. All right. So once you install voice.ai and get the account set up, you can now define some parameters. This is the first time I'm using it. So we are tutorializing together. Uh, so here you can see that there are a variety of inputs. So on my device, I have a lot of microphone inputs. I went ahead and selected this microphone here that I have in front of me. And we will go ahead and start to record some audio files using, I believe some well-known voices. Okay, look who we have here. We've got Barack Obama, a very popular deep fake voice to use. We've got Joe Biden. We've got uh, Donald Trump, um, AOC, Bieber. I mean, these are pretty recognizable. But for my tutorial day, the whole point of using celebrities is imagine that the person at your company, it could be anybody that's a target of a social engineering attack, will be manipulated by hearing your voice or someone, someone at your company's voice that they're familiar with. We're only using a celebrity voice here to give you kind of the impact uh, of what that might be because it needs to be believable to pull off a social engineering hack like this. So let's try it. Are you sure you want to train high quality for 4,600 credits? Okay, so this is a credit system. Notice at the top right, I have some coins. It reads that I have 5,705 coins. Um, yeah, why not? Why not? Or actually, let's go back. I'd rather do Joe Biden our current president here. If I'm going to do a one-time training for the amount of coins I have, let's just use that. We will train and use 4,600 credits. Oh, it's training now here in the background. See this progress bar where it says training. I guess I have to wait for that to complete before I can choose this voice character. And once that's complete, I want to run through a couple of social engineering scripts. Uh, potential hacks that could be used against your HR coordinator, your um, AP account uh, rep, your, um, you know, receptionist, a um, high level executives uh, assistant, um, all in an effort to convince the person on the other end that this is either the CEO or someone else that can convince that individual in that privileged position with giving away sensitive information. So let's go for it. So we will want to, oh, here, click to record. Let's try this. Hi, this is Alex. I need some sensitive information about our company's financial statements. Can you please send it to me as soon as possible? We stop the recording. It's processing. Here we go. Hi, this is Alex. I need some sensitive information about our company's financial statements. Can you please send it to me as soon as possible? My mind is blown. It actually converted my voice to Joe Biden's voice in a very convincing way. Not bad. Wouldn't you agree? Click below if you think that was effective. All right. Until next time. Be careful out there.